Young Bess was sitting quietly with the embroidery hoop on her lap. She was embroidering a picture of a little dog on a piece of linen. A greyhound, one of Henry's favourite beasts. But she had let the leg go a bit funny, and the ears were distinctly crooked. She wasn't really concentrating. She was daydreaming. But this was no daydream. She had always thought that the king's beasts, which appeared all over the palace, must have been more than they seemed. Something peculiar was happening. The threads began to reweave themselves into different shapes. She sat bolt upright and stared as they formed themselves into new words. Welcome to our world, Bess. She came to learn that the beasts were really fantastical creatures with the amazing power to spin imagination into reality. They showed her how to go through the secret door in the wall of the tilt yards. And there she found the garden they had crafted from her amazing daydreams. The Garden of the Beasts. (laughs) 